I've been using some videos on YouTube and link them on my Canvas class. This semester, however, I, I ran into a problem when they started charging for the video to be available when it was free last semester. They asked $4.99 to view it. So it's uh, free content disappearing. This is an example of why it's so important to be able to retain the content that you're using. That way you know that you have it and you can control the content. As uh, the Lumen Learning website here uh, describes it, the permission to retain involves making, owning, and controlling copies of the content. If you don't have this permission and you're just relying on links and you're not actually retaining that content yourself in some way, then you are relying on that content just continuing to be made available by whoever put it up there in the first place. So how do you find content that you can retain? Well, there are many ways you could potentially do it, but I can briefly show you using YouTube here. Um, if you want to find out history of the, the American Revolution, let's say, uh, you can just type that in and you're going to get uh, well, over 7 million results, apparently. Uh, but let's say you scroll down and you find one that you're interested in watching. And if you open it up, you know, you can watch the video and you have this... Uh, access to it but what you want to look for is the license how is it licensed so if you just scroll down here to where it says show more you'll note that it says that the license is the standard YouTube license if they want to put it on a premium channel and make you pay for it then they would have that right to do it however if you wanted to you could find the same kind of content but using YouTube you can filter it here by clicking Creative Commons. And this is going to make it so that you're only looking at things that are um, actually available under a Creative Commons license. So here, for example, if you click on this one, um, this here is a, a very reputable scholar delivering a series of lectures on American history. And if you scroll down here to show more, you'll find not only a wealth of information about the, the series coming out of Columbia, but you will also find that it is licensed for Creative Commons reuse. Basically what this means is you have the ability to use whatever tools you need to download this video if you wanted to. You could put this video on your own web page, you could keep it forever so that if for some reason tomorrow, uh, I don't think that they'll do this, but if for some reason tomorrow they decided they wanted to change it so that you would have to pay to watch this, you would still have access to it and you would still be able to provide that free access uh, to other people because you have that right to redistribute it under a Creative Commons attribution license.